it's Bethany at the Kenai Community Library, and we are here today with another Maker Monday. And this time, uh, because we've got May the 4th coming up, we thought we might do a fun May the 4th themed craft that you can do for your stuffed animal or your doll. Um, and what we're going to be doing is we're going to be making a lightsaber for our small friends. So um, what I've got is I've got some sort of shiny metallic tape. Um, duct tape works really good. Um, you don't have to have duct tape. You can actually make it um, a handle out of any color that you want because that's the nice thing about lightsaber handles is they can come in any other color. Um, but uh, we're going to pretend that ours is made with metal, so we're going to have some shiny metallic looking tape here. Um, we're going to have some black tape that we can use to kind of make our handle look extra cool. So we just got some black electrical tape. Um, and then we've got, we're going to be using straws for our lightsabers because they're about the right size for the size of our doll. Um, and if you end up having like a white, white straw from like a to-go place, um, going through the drive-thru, ask for an extra straw. You can actually color these um, with certain markers too. So if you don't have the color you want, you can either pretend or you can actually color them maybe with some marker if they're not the right color that you want. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and build one and I think because she likes to match a lot, we might do a blue because it looks really good with her outfit. So let's go ahead and learn how to make a lightsaber. All right, so what we're gonna need is we're gonna need our tape, our straw, and you might need a pair of scissors. And um, depending on what your friend's um, hand looks like or paw, um, hers is about this big, which is about the width of my tape, so that should be fine for a handle. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and cut a piece of my tape here. And I'm going to go ahead and peel it off the back because this one actually has a little sticky backing. But if you don't have a sticky backing, then you guys can just take your piece of tape you cut and put it right on the straw. And so we're going to take this and put it around um, whichever side of the lightsaber you want. Um, I'm going to put it near the top here a little bit. And I want to put it on kind of slowly so it looks really smooth. Um, if it has a couple wrinkles in it, it's not bad. And then I'm going to take the black tape and I'm going to cut some strips out of that and use it to kind of decorate my handle. So I might put one up here. like that. And that's it. You are done. Um, if you want to do any other little detailing with maybe some marker, you can. Just make sure it's a type of marker that is permanent um, so it doesn't rub off on your doll or on your teddy bear or whatever your little friend that might be. Um, also make sure it dries all the way if you're using the marker before you try it out with them. And then and then once you're all done, um, you can go ahead and just give it to your little friend. Um, so I'm gonna just put this right here. And now you guys are all ready to have adventures in a galaxy far, far away. Um, if you have any trouble getting it to stick onto your friend, um, you might use a rubber band or maybe a piece of tape to kind of help stick it to their hands so that when you're having your adventures, they don't lose their lightsaber um, because their hands are a little bit slick. So have fun and let us know how your adventures go. Take care, everyone.